These are exciting times for artificial intelligence, or AI. But what is AI? AI is the science of making machines smart, using algorithms to allow computers to solve problems which used to be solved only by humans. AI already powers search engines, online shopping recommendations and digital assistants. Radiologists can use AI to calculate the exact shape and volume of tumours, revolutionising treatment. Astronomers use AI to find and evaluate exoplanets in distant solar systems. And unhappy motorists are using it to discover if they can overturn parking fines. The possibilities of AI are endless, from fraud prevention to developing new strategies to address climate change. AI technologies today are brilliant at analysing vast amounts of data to learn to complete a particular task, a technique called machine learning. But AI is not good at transferring what it's learned from one type of task to another. Learning abstract concepts and one-shot learning, where a general rule is learned from a single experience, the sort of broad intelligence humans excel at. But even without achieving this broad intelligence, AI is raising questions. How might AI affect work? People will still be needed in the workplace, but jobs and roles are likely to change as some tasks become automated and new jobs are created. There is a risk that, at least in the short term, this could increase inequality if some people are disproportionately affected and benefits aren't widely shared across society. And what about social equality and fairness? Bias coming from AI systems, even if unintentional, could disproportionately affect some social groups, influencing anything from job prospects to treatment by the justice system. Technology can play a role in helping to manage bias, but people need to address big questions about how society wants to use AI. Technology with AI at its heart has the power to change the world. The more of us that engage with shaping its development, the more chance we have to ensure a better, fairer future with AI.